Introducing Alpha 2, the newest member of your family. Okay, Joyce, let's move to the next pose. Okay. With 20 joints replicating human motion, he's as flexible as a yogi. Good job, Joyce. Alpha 2 is smarter than your smartphone. Rise and shine. And he makes a great tutor. Alpha, what's the word for orange juice in Spanish? Jugo de naranja. Jugo de naranja. Si, muy bien. <laughs> you're cute. No, you're cuter. Alpha 2 is like an in-home nurse or a veterinarian. Hey, boy. Alan, Oliver is due for his flea medication. Thanks, Alpha. Yay! Alpha 2 is the perfect office assistant. Voicemail 3. Joyce, it's Cindy Patterson again. I just saw the cake and it only has five tiers instead of seven. Alpha, call all city cakes and print out a copy of that contract. Okay, Joyce, printing. He's a weatherman. Bye, Alpha. Goodbye, Kate. If you're going out, there's a 75% chance of rain. Thanks, Alpha. And a handyman. All right, I got the flange off. What's next, Alpha? Step four, use a small screwdriver to attach the adapter flange. Thanks, Alpha. Alpha, let's dance. Okay. Alpha 2 is the humanoid robot that makes a fun friend for the whole family. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Take a picture and post to Facebook. And with an expandable platform, his skills keep growing. Alpha, download the Storyteller app. Downloading Storyteller app. Alpha, what's a star? A star is a sphere of plasma held together by its own gravity, appearing as a fixed luminous point in the sky. Would you like to hear a bedtime story? Yeah. Good night, room. Good night, stars. Good night to moms and dads. Good night, light. And good night, locks. Good night, David. Alpha 2. Make him a member of your family today. In a world filled with technology, we have all been looking for something more. The robots we have dreamed of since we were kids. The ones who could be our friends, members of our family. At UB Tech, it's our mission to make these dreams come true. We have a proven track record of bringing innovative technology to market, and Alpha 2 is our latest and best innovation. Please support us today and help make Alpha 2 a reality, because together we can dream of robots. Hello, our Who's that at the door? Thomas, what do you want? So Chef Ramsay. Hello? Blair, I have a reminder for you. Don't forget the family photo shoot at 5 o'clock. I gotta make dinner! Hey Zembo, follow me! Hi, I am Zembo. Today's the big day! The annual family photo! Everyone wants to outdo themselves from last year. In my case, it'll be easy. I just need to make dinner before we shoot. Turns out the 10 pounds the camera has don't go away if you don't eat. Everyone just gets grumpy. Let's see here. I guess I could make celery soup with hot dogs. Or seafood paella. Hey Zembo, help me find a seafood paella recipe. Step one, 
Put the onion and fennel in the bowl and then add some olive oil. Okay, next step? Step two. Place the bowl in the microwave and cook the ingredients for five minutes. Well, well, well. Sixty-five years young. Mine's still sharp as a tack. I didn't even need a reminder about the photo shoot today. Bob, you have one to-do item. Take blood pressure medication. All right. Of course. Back in my day, we knew how to dress for a photo. I'm always adding to my outfit to help keep it fresh. Thomas! Big guy, how about adding one of those leather belts to Grandpa's outfit? Uh, sure, need help ordering it? Smart as a whip, my boy! Okay, just click on, buy it now, and press on log in with the account I set up for you last time. B O B A W E S O M E. Did I ever tell you you're my favorite grandson? Ow! Grandpa, I gotta go! To what do I owe the pleasure? No, no, no. To whom do I owe the pleasure? It's not where are we? But, when are we? Yes. Wolf, 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 wolf. All right, kids. Get over here. Hey, Zembo, let's read The Big Bad Wolf and the Seven Little Sheep. You ready? After the door opened, the postman turned out to be the big bad wolf instead! <laughs> I'm the big bad wolf! I'm going to eat you! Eat her, not me! Uh, ah! My little sheep, cover your face and don't let the big bad wolf find you! You think I can't find you? I will eat all of you little sheep! Dad, this story is better than your last book. Whoa, whoa, that's harsh. I guess playtime's over. Daddy's got to go work on his craft. Fine. Hey, Zimbo, let's play fun Christmas. Do you know how bees communicate with one another? Do they dance? Yes, they do. <laughs> that's right but they also use smell and sound, too. Must be up here somewhere. Whoa. Harsh critics have spoken. I need to edit a few pages before dinner. Oh, no! No, no, no! Are you okay? No, I'm fine. I'm just trying to find my, uh... Hey, what do you know? My scarf! Look what I found. Just stay there. Eric will be over to pick you up. But the pages! You'll be fine. And Sally. I need you to pick out your clothes. Hurry. Yes, ma'am. Don't forget Thomas again. <sighs> hey, Zimbo, play Banana Post by Gary. <laughs>
Hey Zimbo, take a picture. One, two, three, say cheese. This year I want to do something a bit more grown up. Ew, too much lips. Hey Zembo, don't leave that. Done. Please let me know if there is anything else I can do for you. Okay everyone, time to eat. Quickly, quickly. Finally. Except you. You need to change into some real clothes. See what's wrong with taking pictures in my work uniform? Go. Now. Fine. Hey Zembo, unlock the door. Come on everybody, hurry up. Hey Zembo, follow me. It's a pleasure to meet you, Mr. Banderas. You must be Claire. Whoa, 21st century butler. Classy. Uh, please, this way. Beauty, can you bring your chin up a bit? Can we put the lights up, please? Hey, Zembo, can you make the lights brighter? Okay, turning on the light. It's so hot. Just want to make sure no one is sweating. Hey, Zembo, turn on the air conditioner. Okay, turning on the air conditioner. Are you guys here now? Hey, Zembo, turn off the TV. Okay, turning off the TV. Wait, wait! Hey, Zembo! Come over here! Rock and roll! Another year, another successful family portrait. It's easy to look back and think that it shouldn't have come together. That none of it should have worked out. Eric, what's with the face? You guys know I have allergies. But somehow, we always pull through in the end. The only thing that looks good in this one is Grandpa's hat. I think we found a winner. As much as I would like to take credit for everything, I can't. Thanks, Zenbo. Meet Ido. What can I do for you today? Ido is a part of your family. Good morning. He's an intelligent, capable, and affordable companion. He can do just about anything.
help you have always wanted. A handyman. teacher, a friend, this is fun, he is perfect in every way, He can be just about anyone. A carer. A homemaker. He's a personal butler who's trustworthy. He is whatever you want him to be. Ada, can you show me the movie story? Sure. I started off as an idea to make cutting-edge robotics friendly and useful to the home, while being affordable. I have been overwhelmed by all the love and recognition I have received so far. Now, I need your help and support to make me really great. Adopt me as your new companion at home. Ido from InGen Dynamics. Coming soon to your home. In today's hectic world, it's getting increasingly difficult to remember what truly matters, the health of you and your loved ones. But now, someone can help. With his artificial intelligence, Pillow recognizes each and every member of your family and starts caring for them. Clara, here are your cholesterol pills. I see you're running low. Shall I reorder them for you? Thank you, Pillow. That'd be great. Pillow is 100% secure, and his skills and functionalities will grow the more you use him, the more he gets to know you. Here are your vitamins to go. Enjoy your training session, Liza. Thank you, Pillow. Since Pillow's always connected, he can answer all of your health-related questions. Pillow, how many calories are in a celery stick? Six calories, Clara. Celery is excellent for your health. Great. I'll have a bunch then. Aww. Good morning. <laughs> Pillow is simple to set up and makes the management of complex medication regimens very easy. He'll remind you so you'll never miss a dose again. Wait, John. It's Tuesday. Here's your blood pressure medication. You're right. Thank you, Pillow. And if you want, he'll notify your caretakers in case of an emergency, like when he forgot his heart medication. Hey, Dad. I just got a message from Pillow. Everything okay? Because, you see, Pillow's not just a member of the family. He's a true healthcare companion. 
And since he can sync with any wearable and wireless devices, Mark can share his combined health and wellness data through one secure, user-friendly platform where he receives fast and reliable feedback. Goodbye, doctor. Thank you, Pilo. Because sometimes, all you need to stay healthy is a friendly, timely reminder. And that's exactly what Pillow will do for you. We created Pillow to address a critical need, the health and well-being of you and your loved ones. We've assembled a great team of healthcare professionals, entrepreneurs, and robotics experts with years of experience in the field. And we have what it takes to make Pillow a reality. We now ask you to join us as we enter the next exciting phase of bringing our prototype to production. Together, we can reinvent the future of personal health. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Pilo. Since kids get distracted easily, parents are always concerned about how to best communicate with their kids. As education experts say, it is crucial for parents to help kids form good habits in this stage. Now we have HoneyBot, the first educational family robot designed especially for young kids. Distinguishing from other similar products, we have integrated AR technology into interactive activities. For example, kids can draw a picture and then HoneyBot will recognize the object and turn it into animation with educational explanation and music. We have also prepared many flashcards of diverse objects. With AR technology, kids can show the flashcards to HoneyBot, and HoneyBot will display the objects on the screen in 3D form with explanation to help kids learn and memorize. HoneyBot's habit-forming system was designed to help parents guide their kids to develop good habits easily. Kids can keep a virtual pet with HoneyBot. Like a real pet, it will get hungry, dirty, and tired. As the pet owners, the kids will need to feed it, give it baths, and put it to bed according to different scenes. From such interactions, kids will be able to gradually build good habits. Besides its educating function, HoneyBot is also designed to help communication between parents and kids be more fun and effective. Parents can use the voice changing function with smartphones and send a voice message to HoneyBot. HoneyBot will then play the message to kids with a funny voice. Even when parents are miles away, they can video call their kids and talk to them face to face. We hope that HoneyBot becomes the angel of your home by providing good company for your kids, helping you and your kids bond, and helping kids gain knowledge and develop good habits. Considering the safety issues, we only use the safest and most environmental friendly materials to make HoneyBot, and we made it into more of a round shape without sharp angles. We have already finished R&D and small batch production. Now we need your help and support to mass produce HoneyBot. Please support us and make HoneyBot into reality. <laughs>